it's Gianna Lama of Visit Crypto, where we keep you in the loop on all the latest trends and news of crypto and blockchain technology. Together, we're building crypto movement, the fetch climate justice, and economic empowerment. We're at the other location again. We actually have Fluke on the side there, so if you see a dog pop in, that's Fluke, but he's just chewing on the side, so you might hear some nibbling noises. Um, I've been talking with a lot of you lately on social media, so if you haven't yet and you want to connect further, you can check us out on Twitter and Instagram. I'll link all that below, too. Um, we're going to have another special guest next week, too, but check out our latest uh, big interview with the new Cardano project. Um, they're the Nether Protocol, and I talked with the entire team, and they're doing some great things in Latin America. But today I want to talk about another Cardano project that's going to help um, grow the ecosystem. Here's the article. Bashoswap building a Cardano-powered decentralized exchange. Once Bashoswap launches, Cardano users will be able to swap their tokens. They'll also be able to gain liquidity to earn LP fees. And there's also going to be a special launch pad for anybody who wants to launch a Cardano project and gain some support and funding for that. So this is really great news for developers, anybody who wants to swap their tokens. And I think this is a really good way to, to get more people into the Cardano ecosystem. Bashoswap's mission is to develop disruptive dApps like permissionless on-chain staking, lending, and governance protocols. And things that are specifically tailored for the Cardano ecosystem and helping revolutionize both decentralized finance and the cryptocurrency world as a whole. We're going to say dApps. It's going to happen. dApps are decentralized applications, and we're going to see more and more of them continue to grow on Cardano with both the launch pad and the swapping mechanism. This is a pretty new project. And of course, when there's a young project that I find, I make sure that it's legit, that it's not a scam. And the best way to do that is to stalk their team. So I looked who their team is, their LinkedIn profiles, they're all real people. So that's a good sign too. I looked at their roadmap to make sure that they have tangible goals. They don't have everything for phase five yet, but phase one, they're announcing the Basho Swap project. They launched on social media, on Twitter, Medium, and Reddit. They created their Basho Swap project awareness on crypto forums for the early adopters. They launched this website and they have their Telegram community and their white papers now in English. For phase two, they have their AMA and get to know the team sessions. They have the BashoSwap partnership and ambassador program. They are completing the BashoSwap POC for staking, swap liquidity. They are getting NAMI wallet support, BashoSwap presale IDO, community reward program, research for UTXO economics models. And then phase three, they have the BashoSwap ISPO, they are publishing their white paper now in multiple languages, formalizing BashoSwap DEX and staking protocol, incentivize public testnet, DEX and SEX exchange listing, the coin market cap, coin gecko listing, BashoSwap DEX launch, and the Bash liquidity mining program. And by phase four, they have Bash staking, BashoSwap protocol audit, Bash USD and Bash gold, and the extended AMM functionalities and MetaMask support. So they definitely want this to be something that's going to be accessible for people all over the world. So it's not just going to be in English. They're going to have it in multiple languages. And they also want to be really transparent too. So I want to share what the tokenomics of the Bash token are. 10% is going to the team and founders, 3% to the advisors, 20% for private sale, 13% for pre-sale, 9% for ISPO, 25% liquidity, and 20% for locked treasury. So I'm really excited for this automated market maker on Cardano. It's going to make trades really seamless. There's no KYC, so it's going to be accessible for anybody. And it's going to be really supported by the Cardano ecosystem. It's going to help it scale up. So these are some reasons why I really am supporting this project. But let me know in the comments below if you have some concerns about it or your opinions. I always like hearing everybody's opinions here. Let me know in the comments below if there's any other projects you want covered on the show. If it happens to be your project, I'd love to have you on the channel too. I love having guests here. But yeah, let me know what you think. Um, always here to have more conversations about Cardano, about how blockchain technology is changing the world. Oh, Flu, wanna come back up? No? Okay, Fluke doesn't wanna say hi to you guys today. I'm sorry. But that's it for us today. Feel free to like, subscribe, and comment your thoughts. Feel free to connect with us on social media too if you want to connect further. Uh, share this with your friends if you enjoyed this content. And I'll see you next time, everyone. Bye.